Are you looking for the best mini PC? In this video, we'll break down the top mini PCs available, whilst comparing them for price versus performance. Before we get started with our video detailing the best mini PCs on the market, we've included links in the description for each product mentioned, so make sure you check those out to see which one is in your budget range. Starting off at number 1, we have the Intel NUC 8 Performance G-Kit. As its name suggests, the Intel NUC 8 Performance G-Kit is the most powerful mini PC that was ever produced by Intel. During development, this beast was codenamed Hades Canyon, and that says a lot. Also, it's worth mentioning that this little monster harbors a very special quad-core processor under its cool chassis, the Intel Core i7-8809G respectively. This is some kind of hybrid, as it was developed in a historic partnership between the world's two bitter rivals, AMD and Intel respectively. Basically, this state-of-the-art processor binds together into an unholy union, an Intel Core CPU with an on-chip AMD GPU, the Radon RX Vega MGH respectively. Yes, you read that right, Intel and AMD are joining hands on the same processor. The Radon RX Vega MGH GPU comes with 4 gigs of HBM2 memory, and it's VR-ready, which means that besides seamless gaming, you'll also benefit from an immersive VR experience, if that's your cup of tea obviously. In case you were wondering about Intel joining hands with AMD, this move is aimed at mitigating the inherent problems of Intel's in-house HD graphics GPU, which is not powerful enough to offer gaming aficionados a smooth experience. The new hybrid chip made by Intel and AMD are claimed to be equivalent to a GeForce GTX 1060 Max-G GPU, which is kind of awesome. On top of peak performance, the Intel NUC 8G kit will support up to 6 4K displays, featuring front read HDMI ports, two mini display ports, two Thunderbolt 3 ports, and no less than seven USB ports. At number two, we have the HP 600 G2 microcomputer. The HP 600 G2 is a very affordable mini tower PC powered by an Intel i3 dual core 6100T CPU. Even if the CPU performance is not stellar, this little fellow comes loaded with additional goodies, the likes of 16 gigs of RAM, a 256 gig solid state drive, and Windows 10 Pro. As far as specs are concerned, the HP 600 G2 offers strong performance and solid hardware at an unbeatable price, thus playing in the best bang for the buck category and winning by a long shot. If you're looking for a no-nonsense, business-centric mini PC, the HP 600 G2 will get the job done with flying colors. At number 3, we have the Minex Neo N42C4. The Minex Neo N42C4 is a great choice if you're simply looking to stream. The ability to browse the web, play breathtaking Ultra HD content, access Kodi, Skype, and more is packed inside a 5-inch square that's less than 1 inch tall. The Neo has been painstakingly designed to provide the most stunning home cinema experience possible. Powered by Windows 10, the Neo is capable of outputting crystal clear 4K at 60Hz. Going a step further, the engineers at Minix have embedded a proprietary suite of technologies that improve upon the 4K standards and further enhance the already ultra-sharp images. All these cutting-edge enhancements, however, would be worthless without robust connectivity. A spotty connection can easily ruin an otherwise pleasant streaming experience. No corners were cut when it comes to high-tech antenna architecture found in the Minix Neo N42C4. The designers have used the latest 802.11 AC technology. An array of dual-band antennas covers 2.5 GHz and 5 GHz, resulting in a lightning-fast and highly stable connection. At number 4, we have the Intel NUC8 Mainstream Kit. The Intel NUC8 Mainstream Kit is yet another tiny yet powerful mini PC, running on an Intel Core i3 8th generation CPU, which features Intel Iris Plus Graphics 655. On top of that, you have an M.2 22x4280 slot for PCIe NVMe or SATA SSD, a 2.5-inch SSD HDD bay, and support for up to 32 gigs of DDR4 dual-channel DDR4 2400 sodium RAM. In terms of connectivity, you'll get dual-band wireless, Bluetooth 5.0, SATA3 support, Thunderbolt, USB 3.1 USB Type-C, along with 7.1 channel surround sound, dual-array microphone, and HDMI. As an interesting factoid, the Intel Iris Plus Graphics 655 GPU supports up to three 4K displays. So if you're looking for a small and silent machine to perform usual tasks like office work, watching YouTube or video stream, and things of that nature, the Intel NUC 8 Mainstream Kit will get the job done with flying colors. Despite being a bare-bones mini-tower PC, the Intel NUC 8 Mainstream Kit is everything about upgradability, versatility, and affordability in a professionally designed miniature form factor. If you're looking for a cheap, no-nonsense, all-in-one mini PC, the NUC 8 Kit may be the answer. At number 5, we have the Asus Chromebox 3 N017U. 
the Asus Chromebox 3 N017U is an entry-level mini PC, which comes with the latest gen Intel Celeron 3865U processor under the hood, seconded by 4 gigs of RAM, along with a gigabit LAN card, 802.11 AC Wi-Fi, and a 32 gig M.2 SATA SSD, i.e. the basics required for surfing the interwebs and performing light office duties and things of that nature. Furthermore, the integrated GPU is 4K capable and can support two monitors via DisplayPort, Type-C, and HDMI connectors. This cool mini PC comes preloaded with Chrome OS, which means it's fully compatible with thousands of Android apps, available on both Chrome Web Store and Google Play. There's also built-in antivirus protection, so you won't have to waste time and resources on security software, and on top of that, you'll get instant access to your files from basically any location. The power delivery over USB Type-C feature in this Asus Chromebox mini PC helps you deliver power to mobile devices, projector or monitors sans additional cables, so it will help with minimalizing cable clutter. If you can't afford an Apple product and you want out of the Windows ecosystem, Chrome OS may be the answer. At number 6, we have the Dell CFC5C Optiplex 3050. Next in line, we have a Dell CFC5C Optiplex 3050, a machine which boasts almost legendary status. This Dell is basically a 7th generation Intel i5-powered, microform factor desktop PC running on Windows 10 Pro or Linux, depending on one's personal preference. Besides the powerful quad-core i5-7500T CPU, this Dell boasts 8 gigs of RAM and a 256 gig SSD. Basically, if you're looking for sheer desktop-like power in a smaller form factor, this Dell Optiplex would cut it for you, provided you're not discouraged by the price tag, which is a little steep for what this machine really is. The main argument for going Optiplex, besides Dell's legendary reliability and industry-leading security and manageability, I mean, is the compact form factor, which uses 60% less surface area compared to regular desktop computers. And for our final pick at number 7, we have the Ace PC AK2 Mini PC. Truth be told, this AK2 machine is made by a relatively unknown brand, making for a mini PC running on Intel's Apollo Lake family of low-powered Celeron Pentium CPUs. Despite being a new kid on the block, so to speak, this Ace PC machine will give you a good run for your money. And speaking of money, you'll get a lot of bang for the proverbial buck with this baby. For under $200, you'll receive an Intel Celeron J3455 CPU, 4 gigs of RAM, and a 64 gig eMMC, along with gigabit Ethernet, dual band Wi-Fi, and Bluetooth 4.2. Or to put it another way, everything the body needs, to quote a classic movie i.e. with the AK2, you're all set up and ready to go, as in you don't require buying any additional components to surf the web or whatever. Truth be told, these are pretty impressive specs for the price asked. And don't worry, despite its low price tag, this nice mini PC is excellent for home office tasks, surfing the internet, watching YouTube videos, and even light gaming. So that sums up our top mini PCs of 2020. We hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like on the video, and if you're new here, hit that subscribe button. Until next time, have a great day.